morning guys so Declan wants somebody to lay with him and I just uploaded or I just started editing the vlog but babies come first here we come the pillow is messed up mm -hmm. good morning good morning <laughs> Mommy's gonna take a shower here in a minute, okay? Okay. I love you. I love you too. Are you stretching? No, I can't do this. So you made me come in here and lay down with you? Uh -huh. You don't even want to lay down? I just want to see you more. Say good morning. All the way in here to cuddle, and he doesn't even want to cuddle. Good morning, Badger. Good morning, Uncle Nicky. In the closet. <laughs> can't even see you. Badger, really? I can't see you. Badger, really? I went in here and talked and everything. You didn't get up. You hear Declan, you get straight up and you run out there. Huh. <laughs> Mommy needs a shower this morning. I don't know what's up with Ninja. What's up? You hungry? You hungry? Okay. And then here, oh shit. Did you eat all your food or did Badger eat all your food? Ooh. Okay, hold on. Let me get you food. Excuse me, Ninja. Back. My poor baby. I know. She can't see. You need help? Hi, Ninja. Hi, Badger. Ninja. It's her food. <clears throat> Aw, she's loving on it. What do you need my help with, baby boy? Here, mommy's gonna go make some. I'm gonna have a bagel, cause I had one yesterday and it was really good. So I'm gonna have a bagel for breakfast again. What a clip do? Okay, there's my bagels. I have to clean, so. I'll let y'all know before I start cleaning, and then that way, if y'all don't want to watch the cleaning vlog, y'all can just leave. But um, I got like the whole house to do, so I'm gonna make this bagel, and then edit the vlog, and then start cleaning. First messaging. Oh. <laughs> I don't think it caught it. Okay, so um, I just. Uh, I've been trying to figure out what to say about the situation going on and um, with uh, Alton Sterling and then I, I'm sorry, I don't know the other guy's name, the one that happened in the car. Um, I haven't really seen them mention any, uh, his name. I know the woman's name is Diamond Reynolds. Um, I think that was his girlfriend. Um, but, uh, I just, like, I put a status out that said something, um, here, let me get to it. I had posted a status, but before I read the status, I want to say something about, um, pretty much, 
um, about how, I want to say what Garrett said, my brother. I had texted him and asked him where does he stand on the situation and um, I was like these cops and everything that's going on, I, I, I want to know. And he goes, I mean, what the cop did was excessive, but I'm not sure. I'm sure he felt like he had to, had to for some reason, and even if he didn't have a reason, he's not a representation for all cops. Uh, like, that's like what he put. And then, let me see if I can find. Okay, so this is what I put. I put another one. Um, I didn't put it, but I had commented on one of my friend's statuses about how yesterday I woke up and my brother was on the phone and I had no idea what was going on. I didn't even check social media like I usually do. I just... I just got up and I was like, okay, time's your day. And he asked me what I thought about what was going on. And I was like, I have no idea what you're talking about. And like watching it, it just like broke my heart. And I just, I don't know, it was just hard to watch. Um, so I'm going to say what I said on my status because I don't know what I exactly said on that comment. And I don't want to like misword it because. Right now, like, this subject, it just, it makes me cry. I get angry. I get outraged. I get, it's just, it's bad. Like, I don't know. And, um, this one was actually before I had seen or heard about the one with the, in the car. So, this was just me going off of what, um, Sterling went through. I think his first name is Alton. Sorry if I'm not pronouncing that correctly. But um, I was like, we as people need to stick together. Not as different races. We as people. We need to stick together. I was taught there were no colors. I never saw colors. Not for the longest time at the least. I was oblivious to what was going on. Growing up in a small town and seeing the videos from yesterday honestly broke left me broken left left me heartbroken left me speechless left me confused and outraged but i'm not going to turn on all cops in the world because of this cop who i don't even i don't like i'm i'm confused at this point in typing but because of this cop who i don't even know what happened like i can't even put it into words how confused i am we need cops just not the dirty ones I have family members who were cops and I have friends in the force and they can show you not all cops are dirty but either way we as people not as we not we as white people or we as black people we as people need to stick together sadly racism will be there but we but what we can do is teach our kids but also stick together for myself I don't need answers I want his family I want both families to get the truth and get peace. Right now, Sterling's family is in my prayers and so is Diamond Reynolds. Um, get mad, get upset, but stick together. All lives matter whether you're white, black, or brown, even blue. And if you don't know what blue is, um, blue is the police. Um, and then my friend put, yeah, preach it, team human. So I guess I am a team human because um, my friend just asked if I played Pokemon Go, sorry. Um, but, um, like, it's just, it's an outrage, it's disappointing, it, I, I am not, it's hard to understand Like, okay, sorry. Somebody had put a live of the Diamond Reynolds. Um, Diamond Reynolds was the girlfriend, I believe, in the, um, and her boyfriend's, the one that was in the car. I'm sorry, I do not know his name. Uh, 
I really don't know what's going on with everything. I didn't speak out when um, uh, Grammy passed away, and I didn't pa uh, say anything when Pulse, when the whole Pulse shooting happened. But I just, I'm a person who I love everybody, and I really don't have hatred for people in general and knowing that there's just so much that keeps happening it's hard to kind of not it's kind of hard not to say anything because it's everywhere and I don't want you guys to think that it's not affecting me um it is I have a lot of friends affected by this like they don't know the family personally but it's affecting them deep down and it's just getting it's affecting ninja too because she's meowing i don't know why she's meowing come here um i feel like i don't need answers i would like answers but i don't need them if that if that means that um their families aren't going to get answers because i rather them get the full investigation, the full everything. So, they can get answers for their family. And both families. I mean, I I was a little confused because one of, I, I did not know about the, um, the Reynolds one. I don't, I wish I knew his name. Um, but... I am, um, like, I didn't know about that one until somebody had posted something and they said, um, hold on, I actually commented because I was confused. I thought I had, oh, I was actually on that status. Um, she said, the shooting in Minnesota, so sad. All cops aren't evil or racist, but that cop was sh that shocked that man, that poor man was. And I was like, wait, what? Like, I I didn't know I thought like I guess for some reason I thought that a cop was shot just from the way she worded it but she's talking about a um, man the uh, not Sterling the um, Reynolds guy was shot and um, in Minnesota and that one I was like, wait, what? And then my other friend had actually just shared it. And I just sat there and I was like, is this is this really happening? Like, why, why do this when everything, like, I don't, it just, it, I'm speechless. That's the thing. Like, I, it makes me angry and I know it does not help that I am pregnant because I get angry and then I cry and then it's not pretty and it's just like my brother and I we sat there and talked about it and it was just and then on one of the interviews anytime ninja come here there's no way you're back in heat you just like got out of it like a week ago But, um, there's an interview, and I have, I, I'm guessing it was for Reynolds, because I know for Sterling, they did the, um, his son, and I think his wife, and, um, I wish I, I can, like, just, like, get my brain to work, but in the interview, anytime she mentioned any of the the problems with how they feel they would either skip over the question like they would interrupt her and say okay well we're asking you a different question and then it like got spliced up and it was like somebody said it was like really like a 44 minute interview and they cut it up to like a 20 minute interview so 
I mean, it's just, it's heartbreaking and I wish I could do anything. All I can do is put you in my thoughts and prayers and I mean, I just believe that we should all stick together and something needs to happen with the cops. I believe that you should not be biased or racist or anything being a cop. And I believe that um, you pretty much just are doing it to protect yourself. Uh, my friends, they actually had posted something because somebody, somebody else had commented on their profile saying that they only, that most cops only pull over the black people and my friend was like I'm sorry I pull over way more white people because they're horrible at driving and I was like are you serious and then I saw another video of somebody he got pulled over for in use of a horn a false use of a horn or something like that and I commented on the video I was like my friend, like I had a friend, we were driving around, and the only way her son would stop crying is if she would honk her horn. Well, we got pulled over because she was honking her horn, and she, she like had to do a sobriety test and all this stuff, and she was like, my son will stop crying if I honk the horn. And it was just like, and I just thought it was funny that somebody else had, because I, I had never heard of anybody else getting pulled over for honking their horn. And it was just funny. I mean, it made my friend laugh, but I'm pretty sure if I had commented on the actual video, it wouldn't have been funny. But it was just funny because I was just like, my friend actually did get a, like, a ticket and everything for getting pulled over for whatever it is for <laughs> misusing her horn. <laughs> But, uh, the only thing I can say is if you don't feel safe, that one wants Baba, but if you don't feel safe, and chocolate, he wants milk and chocolate. <laughs> um, if you don't feel safe, stay home. Um, if you do get pulled over, and if you don't feel safe, record, um, uh, Cliff had actually told me to do that like anytime you get pulled over or anything so that way you have video proof of what was said and everything and um, all I can say is we as people need to stick together and not divide um, it's already hard enough as it is as humans to live let alone having different races not like each other. But, um, as my friend said, I'm team human. And, um, if you don't know what is going on, um, I will, if you comment down below, I will be sure and try and get back to you and let you know a little bit more of what happened. But, I it's just it's heartbreaking and like I said my my heart goes out for both families and I wish it it shouldn't have happened um both scenarios I would like answers but like I said the families deserve more of the answers than the public does um but my heart hurts and I feel like this video is probably the longest clip I have ever done, but it needs to be said. And, um, yeah, I'm going into my, the rest of my vlog and on um, my day, I'm going to start cleaning up my room here in a minute. I just need a second to get back into not wanting to be a hermit and just sit here and cry. So... His name was Philando Castile. The, um, the other person that I was trying to, um, uh, like, 
think of. So, his name is Philando Castile. I hope I'm saying that right, but I just wanted to put that out there if you are going to search for it. So, it was Alton Sterling and Philando Castile. I feel like I'm not saying that right, but. So sad. Okay, hold on, baby. So, Duckling's crying about something. <laughs> Duckling's crying about something, and it's been. It's 3.55, and I haven't cleaned up much. Um, oh, and I have peanut butter on my face. Okay, I had a peanut butter jelly sandwich with the stuff still right here. So, um, Cliff just actually said he's leaving the shop. So, yeah, that's great because, hey babe, I didn't do anything like major today. But, God, I peanut butter all over my face. But, um, I was like literally getting up to go and finish cleaning and stuff, and Clip texts me that he's leaving the shop. So that's kind of cool. I have a lot of laundry to do, and I don't know what that one's doing. I'm watching some games. Oh wait, these are plastic that go in the trash. So, yeah. Jacqueline. What? I love you. I love you. You okay? You okay? Hey. Oh, but then power gets you. Oh. Oh, my spaceship. I know. Oh, did I feel better? Uh -huh, I was up. You can wait. Daddy's on his way. Okay. I think my brother went to take a nap. I don't know. He just like randomly got up and left. But, um. Yeah. I bought these the other day and I've been looking for them everywhere. So did this, um, what is this called? Counter. I still have to, uh, wipe it down, but that's about it. But I organized it. I actually did that this morning and, um, then I got lazy. So, I don't know. And then I picked up a bunch of the clothes off the floor. I have to rewash them. Yeah. It is so hot. I just walked outside for like two. I haven't even been out here for a minute and I'm dying of heat. It's just. It's hot. It's pretty out, but it's hot. It's hot. It's hot. I'll go upstairs and see what degree it is. Oh, this feels amazing. There's a wasp. The water actually surprisingly like even though it's like barely covering my feet it helped a lot i'm waiting for a clip to get here because my keys are in his truck and i need to check the mail so i'm waiting for him to get here in this box needs to leave my driveway 
Now there's a yellow jacket. I'm allergic to both wasps and yellow jackets and bees and ants. Are you gonna bite me and sting me? I'm allergic to. Sucks. But. Oh, it's gone. Hey guys, so we had Chick fil A for dinner and. Um, with my brother hanging outside. Uh, yeah, that's, that's pretty much all that's been going on. So, 